Hi friends, welcome to my channel and this is VMware Certification VCP 6.5 Data Center Virtualization Training Videos and in this video today I am going to show you how to increase or expand the capacity of VMFS volume or data store on vCenter 6.5. So here is my environment. So in my environment we have a first machine which is uh, Win2K12 DC01 which is my active directory server here you can see my active directory and DNS role is running on this machine you can see the local server this is my computer name domain name and the second machine we have a uh, vcenter 65 which is our vcenter server if you go here let me log into vcenter this is my vcenter 65 server yes, we have installed a vcenter server on this machine so just wait for a few seconds for the login screen so here we go click allow click on login so VMware vcenter single sign on so we are on VMware web client so and we have a three ESX source ESX 1 2 and 3 all three ASX is added to my vCenter server here you can see so and next we have uh, our Starwind virtual sand which is installed on my physical machine here you can see I have installed uh, Starwind virtual sand on my machine and you can see the ISKC and we have a 3 date uh, lens created I have created 3 lens which is going to map in our ESXi host if you go here one of the ESXi host go to data stores you will be able to see here LAN 1 LAN 2 and we have a ISKC so I'm going to expand the size of this LAN 2 so to identify this we need to go to our run virtual SAN you can see the size is around 120 GB and here you can see also it's around 120 gig so I want to expand this so right click here so before um, expanding the data store size on a here on a um, vCenter server we must have to know like we have available space on um, allocated space on our backend which is from where the storage is coming so if I go to settings we have a option here capacity and we have a total capacity 120 and you can see it's around 118 free so if I click on increase it's loading the information so you can't see anything here because we don't have any free space available on our um, this learn or any other learn which we can merge here so if I click cancel here let's go and expand the size so I need to go here and expand size I'm going to expand the size by 30 gig so now you can see the size is going to be a new size of other virtual devices 150 so going to click on expand and now you can see it's expanded and if I go and refresh you can see size is 150 GB now so if it's still if if I click on increase I'm not able to see anything because we need to refresh the storage adapter so if I go on ISKC1 on configuration storage adapters we need to refresh the storage adapter so it's coming from ISKC storage adapter so we're going to rescan now you can see it's rescan HB adapter is running so it's completed now you can see the size has changed to 150 gig and now if I go to data store and if I go here like settings and if I click on increase here we go you can see the new capacity size is 150 gig and learn to so if I click next it will give you option like select configuration we have a f use free 30 gig space to expand the data store so we can go ahead and do this click next and now you can see the future data store sizes become this 149 around 150 uh, gigs so we're increasing the data store size by 30 gigs so click on finish so now you can see exp processing the VMFS data store update so everything done I, now if I go here 
on data store we are able to see 150 gig data stores on LAN 2 so so this is all about how to expand the data store size from uh, ESX or vCenter also we, we have seen how to allocate the space from backend to storage uh, from backend basically from storage or any other storage devices for the you can say the, uh, for ESXi host or uh, vCenter server so this is all about how to increase and expand the capacity of VMS, VMFS volume or data, send, data store so thank you for watching and please subscribe me for more videos and if you have any query any question related to this please post me on my given mail IDs thank you once again bye bye